My name is Rhapsody, his name is Orbital Potato, and welcome back to Warbital. How's it going, Orbital? <laughs> it's going well, uh, Rhapsody. Hey, glad How to hear it. How are you thinking you're going to do with the brand new Celestial class, which we have uh, so far not showcased? I uh, I suspect that I am just going to eat dirt and die. Uh, I do have the correct loadout this time. This is our second time trying to record this video because for some reason I was given the wrong loadout the first time. But it's all good at the moment. Have you got the right loadout? Are we both the super defensive class? I've it's, you don't even pretend. I'm I'm yes I've I've got the right I've got the right loadout. I want to know what do you think? What do you think of this loadout? So if we go through the the first tier. Got a coil gun, refinery, orbital boost, and a laser blade. What do you think? Yeah. Uh, I don't know about the laser blade. Surely that's just defensive, unless you're in super close. I think it can. Al yeah, I think it can also be used to move the planet somehow, just like the Gatling gun of the previous. Oh, uh, so it has like a fault behind it. Yeah, I believe so. I believe so. Slightly, just okay. just slight. I'm glad to hear it. Uh, I, I've never played this character, so honestly, I don't know what I think of them yet. Um, I'm gonna actually, uh, check what they get in their upgrades for their next tier, because that'll probably decide it. They get the attack ship, Glacier, uh, disables structures on hit, and fireworks, which I built a bunch of last time before I recognized that, oh, that doesn't work. That's just for, like, destroying ships, I think. Yeah, I don't know, I don't really know what fireworks do. It's a little bit of a weird weapon, but... We'll see. At the very least. All right, okay. so we're on, like, complete opposites. Wait, what? I can't even see you, right? Oh, I'm very close, close to you. That's why. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't even thinking about that. Oh, no, really? Ah. Okay, so it's interesting that these coil guns, they have a... They have a little, a little thingy which allows you to... To allows you to break up the shell just before impact. Yes. So you can get kind of a bunch of spread damage going on. I like it. Oh, that came around the world back onto you. Hell yes. The roundhouse. Mm. Oh, <laughs> you sneaky little blighter. <laughs> he went for a little boosty McBoost face there. Yeah, of course. That was a little bit uncalled for. But that's okay. All right. So what are you thinking, like... Oh, come on! No way. I think I may have just destroyed one of your facilities there, bud. I think you might have destroyed my refinery, yeah. Ooh, that doesn't sound good. Ah, it doesn't okay. really sound good at all. Okay. Just gonna be repairing my own while we're here. <laughs> this is great. I'm so glad you dodged that because I missed. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. So how how much do you reckon we're gonna value? Oh. Oh, do you have to? Oh, you have to hold to boost your. You have to hold. You have to hold to boost your planet. Yeah. Oh, so it's so it's not super ideal, but there you go. All right, so what do you think of the whole orbital boost meta? I mean, I don't know. I, I don't like it because it's being used against me, frankly. <laughs> yeah. Did I just straight up destroy one of your facilities there? No, it's still alive, technically. Damn. That's what matters. The technicality is what matters there. That is true. Nestle. Nice. Oh, well, you got some straight up Nestle going on there. I like it. I like it. The good thing about this coil gun is that if you don't think you're going to hit, you can preemptively split it apart so it gets a way bigger spread. Mm hmm. Dude, I'm telling you, there's so much like hidden meta. Oh, yeah. No, I'm certain that we're missing like the vast majority of what we should be doing right now. Yeah, I think I think so. All right, what have we got on tier two here? Fireworks, glacier, and an attack ship. Oh no. 
No, oh, no, that was a very, very poor boost. <laughs> You're boosting yourself into me. And not only that, but into the two shots I'd already fired. Oh. Oh. Oh, gravity. Damn it. Slang shot around you. Have you got two different boosts? Yeah, just one on either side. So I can just boost out of whichever direction you're not going to be in. All right. Well, that's one way to do it, I guess. I feel that's the only way to do it, really. All right. All right, there we go. Yeah, hey, yoink. <laughs> <laughs> what? That is such a such a crazy weapon. Wait a second. There's there's a golden asteroid over here. I'm just gonna destroy it for a bunch of money. That's that's what gold means in video games. Oh, you've got a spaceship. Hey! You've got an attack ship. How much money did you get actually? Uh, I got two hundred uh, dark matter, and I think I just got like a couple hundred. Ah! No! I, I, this ship is too fast. I need a slower ship. All right. All right. Oh, you have your own attack ship here. Oh, oh, this is not a very effective attack ship. No, not at all. Oh, you need to be really, really close. Whoa. Oh, that's, oh, that's so ineffective. Okay, I'm just... Okay. It's extremely ineffectual, yeah. Okay, I feel that maybe I'm giving it a bad rap. Maybe it's actually, like, quite good, but I'm just quite bad. Which I think is more than likely what's happened. Come on. Get rid of that. Get rid of that weapon. I'd rather if you didn't, actually. Oh. Boy, that was close. All right, so the attack ship is Garbo. Mm -hmm. Let's give Glacier a shot. Have you got a Glacier up and coming? I feel that like you probably must. I haven't. I don't like the idea of it. It just disables weapons. Whatever. Whatever. All right. <laughs> Boost. Oh, I was clicking the refinery. What? That was a mistake. What? What? Okay. That's a that's a lag right there. What happened? I I boosted past both of those shots and then they hit me. <laughs> ah. Damn it. There are no Australian servers unfortunately in this game as we uh, as we found out when we were doing our testing. To my utter dismay. Uh oh. Boost. Boost. Why are you not boosting? Oh, you boost in the wrong direction at the wrong time. You Stupid, stupid video game. I know. It's rough, ain't it? Whoa, what is this you fired? Oh, that, is that a fireworks? That is indeed a fireworks. I preemptively... What do you think? I preemptively built them because I knew that we would be facing close combat. My truthful answer... Oh, you sly devil, you. Yeah, my truthful answer is that I don't think they're very good. <laughs> okay. Two out of three hitting is an abject failure. Come on. Yeah, so I don't know. What do you think of the fireworks? I mean, you're the ones that are seeing them occasionally hit your planet. Yeah, I'm seeing them hit my planet. I'm not seeing any damage from them, frankly. So you think we're just going to be... We're what basically the hell was that? What? Okay, it's hitting just really random parts. I think using orbital boost is uh, is making my planet appear like it's an area that it isn't consistently. Right, there we go. Yep. Yeah, you're doing some damage. I'll admit that much. That's all that I'm asking for. What are you building? You're building something. That's that's I... two planet rammers. I am not happy with that. That is I not know okay. What you're talking about. I've never seen a planet rammer in my entire that life. Is... Why would I have ever seen one? That is not okay. 
did no one ever teach you that you shouldn't build planet rammers? Uh, no. In fact, I was taught, like, the absolute opposite of that. Oh, were you? Yeah. Oh, you, oh, you sneaky sausage. I was just getting away from you. It's fine. This will make you safer. Oh, please don't mess with a glacier. Oh, it's just... That's rubbing, rubbish. Well, so we got a world rammer and then a colonizer. All right. World rammers it is, what I guess. You? you don't even want to go for colonizer tech? Well, no, because someone is destroying like half the half the planets, really. Mm, it's a fair point well made. Okay, so when are your world rammers going to be coming out? I can feel like it, it, it... I don't know what you're talking about. I would never do something like that. That just sounds mean. That's that's what makes me. Oh, you're boosting back. You're boosting back here. That means that you're coming for me. No, it means that I have a boost on exactly one side of my ship. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was actually quite nice. That, I think that was the first time that I actually used fireworks effectively. Mm, it does seem to have done well for you. Your two world rammers are up and running. Uh, no, they're not. That's just what you think. Oh, that's so worrying. Ow. Golden asteroid? I'm gonna go for the golden asteroid, you know? Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Sounds like a good idea to me. Oh, I didn't manage to do very well. Alright, let's see if I can hit this thing. Nope. Complete failure. That was a complete waste of resources, I must say. Yep. I just lost my colonizer. Uh, because <laughs> a asteroid hit me. <laughs> that's that's so I was, not very I was fun. going for a sneaky, completely different strat, and then the, the asteroid hit me. You didn't have to tell me, you know? No, I didn't, but I, I did want to make note of I got screwed over. I'm mad about it. That look, that's fair. That happens to me all the time. All right. What about your world rammers, though? They must be almost, uh, must be almost finished. What are you talking about? See, this is the thing, right? I feel that orbital boosts are like a way more effective way of protecting yourself against enemy attacks than the whatever it is, the the spread shot. Mm. I just feel like it's arguably just way better. Yeah, they definitely seem a lot more effective. At least that one goes by me. Oh no! Not another asteroid! I think you might just be able to cope with that one. Yeah, that that is that is a good point actually, is that there is no... This class does not have a very good uh, ability to... stop asteroids. Hmm. The hell are you doing? What am I? What do you mean? What am I doing? I'm not doing anything. You're not doing anything. Well, no. then, what's that there? Oh, that's uh, it's gonna miss. That's what it's gonna do. Yeah. I didn't even need to bother. See, I can, you're waiting for you're waiting to use those world drivers. I don't know what you're talking about. I've never even heard of it. They're spinning up right now. I can see that they've got a charge. And you're using a colonizer. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I would never. Look. You know me. If I was going to do something like that, I would say it, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah of course. You think I would say it. You're, you're an honorable guy. You're going around the world with that world rammer? Yeah. Wild. Depends what you I think. Hope it works out for you. Depends what you think the target is, though, right? Hey, you're gonna destroy my colonized planet. That, that wow, you could, you got it in one. Well, let's see if you get it in one. I don't think I will. I did get two hundred monies, which is kind of nice. That's that's not half bad. I don't think it pays off for the <laughs> for the investment. No, I don't think it does either, to be honest, but. 
Ah, oh, there goes my terraformer. You're coming. Oh, goodness gracious. Get away from me. Oh, Lord, he coming. Okay, I'm just going to let that... I'm going to suck it up. <laughs> there we go. Oh, nice. What did I destroy? I destroyed something, I think. Yep, a refinery. A refinery. Oh, I... Mm-hmm. Oh, no! No, 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 no. <laughs> you destroyed my... You got him! You destroyed... Oh, no, you destroyed... Oh, no! No, oh, no, what a failure. What a failure. <laughs> oh. Oh, look at your planet. That is that is a rough time for you, bud. <laughs> I am almost completely decimated here. Mhm. Mm how do you make the fireworks explode, by the way? Do you have to you do just, that manually? No, you, it just does it automatically. It's sort of like a timed... A timed thing. Okay. No! No, who, no, 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 I needed that structure. I really needed that structure, which I... Which just... Which was just destroyed. Mm, sorry to hear it. I, uh, I think uh, you're about to find yourselves on the uh, on the outskirts. Oh no! Punch him! <laughs> oh no 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 no! I've tried to I've tried to to be clever and build a, lo a lot of orbital boosts, but mm -hmm. none of them are facing in the right direction because nothing is nothing is working right. Oh, that was a disgraceful display. Ooh. I didn't even... I Okay, I hate this class. I've already decided. I just absolutely despise this class. <laughs> Honestly, I agree. I think it is way too defensive. Defensive? Yeah, you have like two useful guns. Well, two. One useful gun and fireworks. Like, how do you shoot people yeah. at long range? And especially if you're both playing the same class, you'll never shoot them at long range. I had... Uh, I. I picked up from your extra strat of having another orbital boost uh, just so that I could push myself close to you so that you wouldn't have time to respond to my world rammers. See, that's... But further than that, I had a little bit of a strat. I built those world rammers early so that you would never orbital boost because you were always expecting to be world rammed so that I could shoot you with other things. But there's no good guns for this character other than the world rammer. Yeah, it's a real... It's a problem. See, the, the tier two weapons are just garbage. Glacier... Fireworks mm -hmm. and attack ship, total garbage. Just un just unfun weapons. Did not like. Well, it uh, it seems like what we have to do is then start using loadouts because the characters have the ability to craft your own loadout uh, with different weapons for each of the different tiers. And I feel like that's probably what we're going to be diving into next episode. Until then, though. My name has been Rhapsody, his name has been Orbital Potato. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves as it's been Warbled in beta. Uh, there is a playlist in the description down below with all of our content on this game, past, present, and future, as well as a link to the Steam store page where you can consider picking it up yourself. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves, and hopefully we'll see you next time. Bye.